Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you uh, how to install mods in BrickRigs that are made in a very much easier way than what we've been doing before and also afterwards I'm going to show how to make mods that can be installed this way. Uh, if you install and make mods this way you don't need to use Illusory, you don't need to mess with folders or, or files and get everything just mixed up and unorganized in there it's just a mod folder kind of like in minecraft or simple games that you just slap the mod in the folder and it will work so let's go first i'm gonna show how to uh, install one of those mods even though there are not many out there because i just found about this for brick rigs but uh, there's there will probably be mods for this soon so here's how you install them so first of all uh, you go, I have some mods here that are... Uh, ah, fuck. I have some mods here that are uh, using this way, here they are, they are called fact files. So these three are mods and if I start with the legs right now, you can see that it's a vanilla game. It has no mods. So if I if I join for example in space, which is the map loader map that would should change, it's it's just space. It's completely vanilla. Nothing nothing modded here. The, the guns are just vanilla guns. So yeah, no, nothing special, right? Nothing modded. So I go I grab these mods which are made this way. Uh, map loader three. Star Wars conversion and the twin. I'm gonna cut them and I'm gonna go to my mods folder which is inside my BrickRigs folder, BrickRigs content packs and then you have to make a folder called this little symbol and mods. It's gonna call, it's gonna be called like this and this symbol needs to be here because otherwise it's not gonna work so you have to make a folder named like this then go inside and you paste the mods in here and uh, there are the mods all of the three of them so now I'm gonna open Brick Rigs again and let's see if the mods work so if I go to space there we are mob loader it's working as you can see and well, I can try to join a map, you know, sometimes the first time it crashes, so it might crash, but, oh well, it didn't crash. There you go, the twin, it's installed, just like that. And I can have my, you know, my Star Wars guns, with Star Wars effects, and, you know, everything that these mods do, it's all installed properly. So that's how you install the mods. It's uh, really easy. You just copy them to that mods folder. As long as you put it in the right place and put the right name, you just have to paste them there. So you might be wondering, how do I make a mod like this, a, a pack mod? Well, it's, it's a bit more complicated, but since this is only for m people who make mods, you should be able to do it easily. So first of all, you need a mod, of course, like you, a mod that you have made. Here, for example, I have my Tatooine mod. Where, where, where is it? Ah, here it is. See, I have the Tatooine mod here without packing. You need to be careful to follow the folder structure. So, to, for this to work, it, the name of the main folder needs to be your mod and then underscore P. The underscore P needs to be there because it's not going to work. It, it's there so the game recognizes it as a patch and it applies it on top of the base game so that's go that's the, the main name your mod underscore p and then inside you need to have brick rigs content and then your mod L like the usual you know brick rigs assets and all of that but this is your mod so your your name your, the name of your mod underscore p brick rigs content and the rest so once you have that, you just have to turn that into a pack file. Uh, there are some files for that. I'm going to upload them in the video description. And these are the pack files 
I mean the bad files that turn this into pack for for the for this to work you need to have of course Unreal Engine installed and then you will have to copy these files and you would have to go to your Unreal Engine, your Epic Games folder, your Unreal Engine folder of the version you are using, in this case for Brick Releases for 4.22 2, and then you go to Engine, Binaries, Spring64 and you paste them here, I already have them so I replace them and now in the bottom you can see we have Unreal Pack with Compression, Unreal Pack without Compression and Unreal Pack with that. The one you're gonna be using is Unreal Pack with Compression. So, le let's, let's, we don't have this mod here anymore, the Tatooine mod since we copied it before. Let's, let's use the Tatooine mod to test this. So we grab it and we put it on top of Unreal Pack with Conversion. And now this will appear, you have to avoid it, wait for it to load. It's gonna turn it into a pack. So it's gonna take a little bit. And now when it says press a key to continue, for me it's in Spanish because I'm a Spanish person, uh, then you click any key, it will close, and you will have your pack. And this pack, you just can, can just copy it and go to your mods folder paste it and it, it's done you, you've got your mod in, in working for the game and everything so that's it it's a really simple uh, I, I hope this will make the community uh, be able to use mods easier because until now everybody was struggling with installing them and everything so now it should be a lot more convenient and organized because before you had all the folders and everything that would just get messed up but now it's just a mods folder and your mods and you can take them on and off anytime you want it's uh, really easy so i hope that will help the whole community and that's all i hope you all enjoyed if you have any questions uh, well then ask them in the <laughs> in the brick rigs help server or well you can ask me i guess if i have time i can help uh, and that, that's it i hope it worked for you and bye bye